I could talk for you a little bit. So me show you say Lady V run out last night, right? And she have, you know, she have call all the women them for social media to come together because of time to get rid of Ashanti because enough is enough. And she want to tag everybody, not everybody, all the women them because enough is enough and she can no longer condone Ashanti behavior. And it's time for them, us to get rid of Ashanti and everything. Right? But let me ask, I have a few questions for us, Lady V. I'm going to address our Lady V. Usually I don't call her Lady V because I don't think there's anything lady about her. But today I'm going to call her Lady V. Lady V, when your brother, because I saw you call him, you know, your brother, that's what you used to call him. When your brother was over there disrespecting kids and people, grandkids, why didn't you see it fit to come out then? When your brother was over there and talking about Maxine grandbaby, eating whatever, whatever, and Maxine daughter take too much whatever, whatever, and Tina Chin daughter soon, D-E-A-D, -E which we all know that the young lady have the big C, and that the one the grandson, and that the one the granddaughter, how come you didn't feel it was fit? I remember you in the comment section sending him gifts. I remember you calling into his program and bigging him up. I remember you going on your page and bigging him up and talk about your brother this and your brother that. For months, your brother was out here on top of Marcia Campbell's grandson. The little, the little boy was even one year old. He just turned one year old. Ashanti put up the little baby picture and all the little baby have caca, yeah, yeah, and all the little baby ugly and put up Marcia's son picture and all kind of stuff like that. Why didn't you feel it fit to come out then? There was no urgency then? But at that time, he was defending your daughter who everybody know that she is a a night walker or she bargained her body for money all of that was revealed and you know people talk about it and he would come out and defend your daughter who is a known night walker because god jesus boy let me now come off a topic people but the other day i see that little girl in our video and you know that little girl is not even a hundred pounds right i see that girl in our video they do our thing and I have maybe my old fashioned me never know say a woman can take hood, three hood at the same time. Me never know say all of these different old at the not before and after and at the same time. So they sit me here all three old at the same time. Me said the little girl skill you see Jesus Christ. If you know mystical, you know go over there go see it, my dear. Our videos them all over our place. Uh, place that's Lady V daughter. Mystical. She all over there. Jesus Christ. And the skilly spoon star me ever see it. The little girl bad narrative. So anyway, we'll come off of that for a minute. Me just had to go there a little bit. Yes, Ashanti was um defending your daughter and you paid him and you continue while he was out there disrespecting other people kids and other people whatever whatever so you didn't feel it would fit to come out then but now you and him as pathways and he came out against your friend chit chat and against the margafoot girl htk whatever her name is so now you come out calling for everybody to come together to get rid of him. What's up with this selective outrage? So you wasn't outraged when he was talking about other people's grandkids, but now you're outraged because he's talking about two adults who chose to be on social media? Two adults who is Chit Chat and HTK who chose to be on social media. You come out and defend them, but you didn't feel it was fit for you to defend the little babies that this man was out there disrespecting and putting up them photos. You see that you're a straight garbage though, right? I don't know how can people sit down and listen to you, you know. I don't know how can people sit down. And I do open from what I hear so far, everybody I tell you, if you go suck yourself. 
I do hope nobody listens to you. In my opinion, I am no 360, team 360. I am clearly telling 360, go ahead and cuss out you and the rest of them rotted. Because when he was doing it for months to Tina Chin, Marcia Campbell, Lorraine, name it, none of them have anything to say. Uno cheer him on, you lady be sending money. They can't continue and wish he did. But now because he has turned on your friends, you coming out now said to join force? Only force I would join is to help him bring you down or to help him cuss you. And if I were your friends, I would tell him still I, I would tell you to go have a seat somewhere. Because you are not the right person to come out and call for this. Right? And you know what he's doing is because of his love for Dana. Well, not even his love for Ashanti don't love Dana. Because if Dana ever do one thing, Ashanti ever turn upon him. Why don't you come out and tell Dana, say, tell Ashanti to stop, say, my co-worker and bigger up. Why don't you come out and say that? You can't say that, right? You're scared, right? If she denounce him, if you really want Ashanti to stop, tell Dana to denounce him. Tell Donna, your sister, where you travel from Antigua, where your daughter buy your ticket for travel from Antigua. And my sister, your daughter, put it on her status all the time. She said it. My mom don't have to ask me for money. I send my mom money every month. I buy my mom first class ticket to go everywhere she wants to go. This is why I think this is why you're not so much against what your daughter do. Because as a mother, and I am a mother, my daughter is doing the things that she's doing, those things. Me probably would have fast and pray every single day. It doesn't seem to bother you. You come out and you open everybody mix up. You open up everybody business and look what your daughter is doing out there. So when I hear you come out sometimes and said you talk to your daughter but she wants to live her life, I really don't think you do. I think you encourages her to continue with this dirty life because it financially benefits you. It gives you the first class ticket. She send your money every month. So basically you would help bargain your liquid daughter body for money so you can live big life. What kind of woman are you? I don't know how you have followers over there because you are a person that I could never respect it. Yes, kids make decisions and they do their things that you don't want them to do. Absolutely. But we as parents have to fight to get them straight. Not you. You're up in everybody else's goddamn business except what your daughter do out there. Look how many of the celebrities them run up in your daughter. The last person be here said Dexter Dap of our pan top of one pole and video around and send the video all over. Dexter Dap of our pan top of our wall. And you they come and pop me here, you come online. Oh my my daughter is friends with Dexter Dap. No, she's not friends. She's a Dexter Dap is her client. Oh my daughter was in Voss Vibes Cartel video. What? Lady, did you look at the video? Did you look at the video? Lady V, you are not the person to come out here and call for nothing. You are an embarrassment. And I hope every woman on social media turn by you and cuss out your rotted. And I hope Ashanti cuss you for 40 days and 40 nights. I hope he do. Because when Ashanti was doing it to others, you send him money and you pay him to continue. When you cuss other people pit me, you pay him to continue. So nobody will hear nothing from you. Anyway, guys, I'm going to tell more on a thing. One love.